morning. I, well, good afternoon. It's like two o'clock. Happy New Year's Eve. I'm just dabbling on my pee. <laughs> I'm joking, you. That's so cringe. Oh my gosh. Okay. So today was supposed to go quite differently. I had big plans. I was going to wake up, do my final workout of the year. Honestly, I just felt a bit lazy today. I'm going to play my piano and just relax for the rest of the afternoon, read this book. Uh, Dante is coming over. We're spending New Year's Eve together. Um, I've never really spent New Year's Eve with a boyfriend. Also, I really haven't had a boyfriend since I was like a child. But yeah. Happy New Year's Eve, guys. My name is Kiana. If you don't know me, I'm cool. I'm Jamaican. I live in Canada. That's some backstory, I guess. Uh, <laughs> if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I would love for you to stick around. And I hope you enjoy the vlog. Happy early New Year's. It's New Year's Eve. Happy New Year's Eve. It's six o'clock. Happy six o'clock on New Year's <laughs> <Shut> Eve. That's <up. laughs> my dream. Tell me your favorite moment of 2020. Damn, I don't really have one to be honest. What about all the moments that we spent together? Okay, I mean, obviously. <laughs> I think one of my favorite moments was when we went to the cottage with um, Sierra. Yeah, that's that true. Was that was fun. That was good. Oh yeah, this was all 2020. Honestly, I spent so much time indoors that it feels it's like really it hard to remember right? what is 2020 and what happened in 2019. Summer was fun. The rest of it was a... So guys, we just ordered pizza. Um, we're gonna get drunk tonight <laughs> and Dante says he's not gonna drink, but I'll give you some updates at midnight. Okay. Oh, this can be my time. Jesus Christ. Dante, why, why are you, you so clumsy? Dante, I didn't touch it. Oh my gosh. I like, didn't I, touch I, it. <laughs> Tell the vlog back. Blink twice. What? <laughs> Good. <laughs> Go pay for the fucking pizza. You want. Your wallet's right here. Okay. Remember how you said you wanted dumbbells or weights or any form of equipment? Mm -hmm. I told you I got you something better than that. You did? Yeah, I remember. I opened the box I was gonna wrap it, but it was so freaking heavy, I really just couldn't. Look down. Wow. Holy shit, this is heavy. I know, it's so much. Okay. So okay, it's not a lot of weight. No, no, I'm not mad. I'm, I'm, I'm grateful. Wow. So it's kind of like you actually can make it into a barbell like so. Like so? And you could keep it as dumbbells like so. So generous. I know. And it's clever because I wanted to give you the best of both worlds. Let's see it. <laughs> go, 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 go. Working out with Dante. <laughs> well, love. And the audience. <laughs> um, yeah, thank you for this. I appreciate it. You're so sweet. Thanks to the heater. Shut the f When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. All the good times just begun. Hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy 
so happy saturday i don't even know what day it is it feels kind of weird the days just kind of feel like one right now um but yeah it's saturday i'm about to spend the day studying for my actuarial exam so i am gonna wrap up the vlog but before we do that i kind of want to give some updates and just talk for a bit so first things first i finally figured out my word of the year it's gonna be discipline um, I think a lot of the goals I set, the reason I'm not able to achieve them is because I lack discipline. Um, so discipline in regard to studying, discipline in regard to working out, discipline in regard to finances. Like I think discipline in some way affects every single thing we do. Um, and I just kind of want to zone in on that and kind of just establish more focus in my life yeah so i'm definitely gonna expand on the concept of discipline and see how i can target every single area of my life and be more disciplined and hopefully feel more fulfilled so very happy about that i actually thought about that in the shower um so yeah and then to continue i was thinking about my youtube channel last night and I was kind of just thinking about what changes do I want to have this year? You know, I, th I talked about it in my goals video, how I want to grow to 20,000 subscribers by the end of this year. And it's interesting because I do think that's a pretty high bar to set, but I don't think it's unattainable. I think it just kind of takes consistency, effort, genuineness, genuinity. I don't know, but being genuine and honest and just providing meaningful content that can actually help people. So I'm very excited about my YouTube channel this year. I did a lot of video idea jottings, made a lot of video, I made a lot of video idea jottings yesterday and I'm just very excited for what's to come. Um, and I set my January goals this morning, well, last night into this morning. And I definitely recommend doing that if when you set your resolutions you need to set monthly goals weekly goals i make my goals every single week in this book and I, every month every quarter like i'm constantly setting goals so yeah anyways i am gonna wrap up this vlog happy new year once again i hope this year brings a lot of joy comfort support whatever it is you guys need this year um get very excited for the content that i have planned um like i mentioned in my last video i believe i'm obviously not working as an actuary anymore i'm a student but i just won't have as much actuarial related content to provide for the year um but i will still be providing productive content and just things that matter to me so i i have like a lot of deep chats planned coming up like uh, i'm just so excited anyways stay tuned for that and until then if you guys liked this video please hit the thumbs up button subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you guys next time <laughs>